Memory Lane, Chapter 2 I decided to take my axe and cut a bow and arrows out of the branch that hit my house. It was on the roof still. Climbing up there wasn't a problem. I could climb up the pieces of wall sticking out. The true conflicts were the rain and the axe. It took a while to do it without feeling like it would fall, but I carried the axe with my mouth. The rain was slippery, like ice. The simple and straightforward solution was treat it like ice. It's cold, slippery, and water. So is ice. If you can't beat them, join them. Take it slow. I climbed the wall slowly, one step at a time. I counted eight ledges total. I did the same walking across the roof. It didn't help that the roof slanted slightly. Must have been so rain wouldn't stay and rot the roof. I assumed a bear crawl position, knowing that it would be my sp safest bet. When I reached the branch, I pushed it off the roof. I rewound my actions. I knew that it wouldn't be as safe on the roof, but it would to start the climb down. Once I reached the ground, I went over to the branch. I picked it up and went inside. I took my axe and carefully carved a bow shape out of it. After that, I carved cylinders out of the rest. I sharpened the end of each cylinder, turning them into arrows. I took a piece of straw and tied it to the bow-shaped piece of wood, creating a bow. I decided to cook a fish for dinner, and then I went to bed.